Hello traders, I am Rusov Popov. In this video I will make an overview of Expert Advisor Studio. Let's start with the usual workflow. We have a generator. It uses historical data to calculate strategies from predefined blocks. When it calculates a strategy, it uh, evaluates it and also validates according to predefined rules. It collects all strategies in the collection. A collection is the place where the generated strategies or the strategy created manually in the strategy editor are collected. Here we can sort and filter the strategies in order to choose the best one. Let's take that one. Now we are in the editor. The editor is very important because it uh, shows us the strategy structure, also the input information and the output information from the backtest. Here we can change the strategy, switch on the stop loss and when I click accept the editor will recalculate the strategy and now we have a different profit and different shape of the backtest. We can also change the indicators rules. We have access to the available data. For example, this strategy is calculated on EURUSD H1. When you change the data, the application loads the new files and recalculates the strategy automatically. The program comes with uh, several demo data, but uh, we can put forex symbols, cryptocurrencies, uh, stocks, futures, and uh, all symbols you have in your MetaTrader. The important part of the editor is also the export of expert advisors. Here we can export expert advisors for MetaTrader 4 and MetaTrader 5. As I said earlier, the editor serves to review the strategies and for changing the strategy. The next tool, the optimizer, also changes the strategies. Let's try to optimize that one. We see the current profit is $3067. When I run the optimizer, it tries to change the numerical parameters of the indicators and it tries to reach high profit. Now the profit is almost $8,000. But the biggest problem when we create strategies is the over-optimization. The generator and the optimizer are so powerful that it can fit all trading rules strictly to the available data. And when the new data comes from the real trading, the strategy may not behave in the same way as we expect. In order to prevent that and to make more deep analysis of the strategy performance, we use the Monte Carlo. The Monte Carlo is a very important tool. It uh, checks the strategy robustness. It uh, makes uh, various simulations in order to test the strategies against uh, more severe conditions what we have in the best test. For example, it can simulate market validations. It can also simulate execution problems, the strategy parameters, and uh, the backtest starting. Let's run it. It makes these simulations and puts all calculated uh, balance lines on the chart. If we switch different uh, options, we see, we see different uh, results. And the purpose of this uh, tool is to filter the strategies that are potentially over-optimized. We want this uh, simulation to show only profitable results. Multi-market is also a validation tool. It was the date and proceed with the backtest. Now we see the result. The best result, of course, is on um, EURUSD because this was our original market. The next tool is the report. Here we see more information about the market uh, data we have for this strategy and also more statistical parameters for the backtest. We also have an indicator chart. Uh, we see the entries and the exits. Here we have a short position opening. It closes here. And here we have a long entry and it closes here. Also we see the indicators. We have a balance chart which shows the equity and the balance lines. And journal. This is a walk of all deals. We can export the journal in a CSV file. We can use it in Excel if you want to make uh, further analysis to the results. Next tool is out of sample monitor. OOS means out of sample. Out of sample 
is a simulation of training and trading. If you use auto sample, we generate a strategy by using the training part of the data. And after that, we simulate trading. So we call that part in sample and that part out of sample. Expert Advisor Studio can apply validation criteria against the in sample part, out of sample part, and also against the complete backtest. The tools section of the application has several parts. The first one is the settings. Here we set the account information. The trading session is useful when we want to limit the execution time. The acceptance criteria are used by generator and optimizer. We have uh, three sections, the complete backtest, in sample and out of sample. These are the criteria that uh, are used by the out of sample monitor for validating the, the strategy performance. The indicator page shows us all available indicators for AI Studio. We can switch on and off the uh, different indicators in order to create strategy with only a predefined set. In Data Horizon tool, we can limit the length of the data series and also we can set a start date and end date of the backtest. This is useful when we want to create something called future test in the past. Or we can create a strategy with uh, one set of data and after that to test the strategy on another part of the data. We already saw the data import uh, in our previous videos and also we will speak about it in the next videos because this is very important. We have to always import data from our broker in order to receive the same results in the broker as here in a studio. This was the typical manual workflow, how we create strategy, optimize, validate the strategy with Monte Carlo or with Multimarket and Finally, we export Expert Advisor. But EA Studio also provides uh, something uh, like automated workflow. In the generator, if you click this small arrow, we see another two tools. For example, the reactor. The reactor is uh, the automated workflow. It uh, comprises a generator, but also it includes an optimizer and also Monte Carlo. When you run the reactor, it will first use the generator to generate strategies. When the generator creates a strategy and it passes the validation, it goes to the optimizer. The optimizer runs and optimizes the strategy. When it is optimized, it goes to the next tool we switch on. The Monte Carlo validates the strategy and if a strategy is validated with all tools, then it goes to the collection. So we can automate our working process. We also call this part of the program acquisition because it uh, has a generator, a reactor and validator. We have uh, videos for all these. For more information about the application, please subscribe to our support forum. Here advanced traders share their experience. Also, you can contact us on that email. Thank you for watching. Bye bye.